Now, I'm going to start uh, with this quote from uh, Donald Rumsfeld, which I used to use a lot, and um, I've always really liked. And I think it's, it's brilliant. I came up with this, whoever his speechwriter was, this is actually an amazing quote. So he, and it's very relevant for this lecture. So there are known knowns, there are things we know we know. So we're not really going to be talking very much about those today. And then there are the known unknown, which that is to say we know there are some things we do not know. And really that probably relates particularly to um, the pre-existing pathogens that we know about that are emerging. And then also the unknown unknowns, the ones we don't know, we don't know. And interestingly, when I be, was researching this uh, topic, uh, though there's wonderful mathematical modelers out there um, who are many ecologists working with <coughs> microbiologists, that nobody has ever predicted any of the major outbreaks we've had uh, in the last five, ten years or even before. So that's very interesting. It doesn't matter how good people's modeling is at the moment, uh, they've never predicted the outbreaks such as the one we've had with Ebola or with Zika. So this is what we're going to cover today. Uh, we're going to focus on the challenges from emerging pathogens and the impact on infection control and dentistry. I'm going to describe to you in brief, because obviously there's only hopefully going to be about an hour, uh, the current issues that, that have led to the development of novel uh, emerging pathogens. Uh, we're going to understand how infection is spread uh, in dental surgery. And then we're going to explore, as we go along, uh, latest uh, guidelines and, and current guidelines that help us to deal with these threats. So what's been changing uh, is that the number of cases uh, in heterosexuals has dropped away since 2011. Uh, that's partly due to a reduction in the number of people um, coming from the African subcontinent with uh, HIV because they're So just a quote from President Obama, if we get Donald Trump, I know I won't be quoting from him. Um, and um, President Obama has very good speech writers and, and they're also obviously very intelligent people as well as him being very intelligent because um, they managed to actually plagiarize something from Einstein. And it was originally Einstein who said, though it also was said by President Obama, that if, you'd, if you've done the same thing for 50 years and nothing has changed, then you should try something different if you want a different outcome. And that's very important in what we've been talking about today. So though we can use things developed in the 80s, we've got to try and stay uh, one or not, if not more steps ahead of uh, the pathogens and try and uh, outwit them.